The Beatsons Building Supplies Jim Clark Rally has lined up a bumper entry for both the Jim Clark Rally on the Friday and Saturday and the Reavers Rally on Sunday. And with some classic stages on offer, it is easy to see why this year's event has been so well supported. One of the talking points of this year's rally is the return of the famous water splash in the Langton stage, returning to the schedule after a number of years absent. And if the action over the years is anything to go by, the spectators are in for a treat as the best drivers from the ProBite British Rally Championship, ProTire Asphalt Rally Championship and the Asset Alliance Group Scottish Rally Championship do battle over the closed roads at the Scottish borders. Last year's rally winner Adrian Formo isn't at the event to defend that win, focused on his World Rally Championship campaign this season instead. But there are a whole host of others who will be looking to put their name on a prestigious winner's list, as well as bagging some valuable points towards their championship campaigns. Chris Ingram leads the cruise away from Duns on Friday evening. He currently leads the standings in the BRC and with a win on the opening round, it's safe to say he goes well on sealed surface and will be one of the ones to beat. Keith Cronin starts the rally second on the road. This season hasn't been the best for him in the British Rally Championship, but there was still time to turn that around. He finished second here last year and won the rally in 2022, so he knows these stages well. Ewan Thorburn leads the local fight from third on the road. The Duns driver starting where he finished on the rally last year. But he'd be looking to improve on that, of course, a multiple winner on these lanes in the past, including the Reavers rally last year. He will be back out again on the Sunday for that event as well. A busy weekend for local hero Thorburn and for the other competitors taking on the double header this weekend. In the Pro Tire Asphalt Rally Championship, it will be James Williams leading the cruise away, starting seventh on the road and with a championship lead in the back so far, just ahead of last year's champion Callum Black, who it is safe to say needs a little more luck if he's going to retain that trophy at the end of the season, but you can bet he will be trying. Fans will be able to get close to the cars throughout the weekend in Duns, which plays host to the start and finish of each rally over the weekend, as well as various regroups. And with a big screen TV broadcasting live footage from the stages, it will be a great place to visit over the course of the event. Full spectator information can be found on the Jim Clark Rally website, and the organisers are keen to make sure that everyone attending the event pays close attention to the safety messages on the website and their social media. Listen to the marshals and have a safe and enjoyable weekend of motorsport if you're heading out into the lanes. If you can't attend the rally though, don't worry. As always, you will be able to catch live action from a number of stages over the weekend, as well as live reaction from the end of the stages right here on Motorsport UK TV.